Let's write the structural formula for 4-methyl 2-pentanol. So we also can call this 4-methyl pentan 2-all, but in this video, let's use this one here. They'll give us the same structure. So we see that 4-methyl 2-pentanol ends in OL. That tells us that we have an alcohol. So one of the carbons will be attached to an OH group. That's what makes it an alcohol. The pent, that tells us we have 5 carbons. So we're going to have a chain of five carbons, and one of the carbons is going to be attached to an alcohol. That's going to be carbon number two. On the fourth carbon, we'll have a methyl group. Let's put a chain of five carbons up and number them. So we have one, two, three, four, five carbons. All of these lines go to hydrogens. That makes this pentane, an alkane. Let's put the OH group on the second carbon here. So right now we have to pentanol. On carbon number four right here, we're going to put a methyl group. Methyl groups look like this. For the methyl substituent group, we have CH3. So we're going to attach a carbon with three hydrogens on carbon number four in our two pentanol here. And we could have put that down here as well. These single bonds, they'll rotate. So either way is okay. This is the structure for 4-methyl 2-pentanol. So we have our alcohol because of the OL. We know we've got five carbons, and the alcohol goes on the second carbon. On the fourth carbon here, that's where we put our methyl group. So that's the structure for 4-methyl-2-pentanol. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.